is up everybody and welcome to another episode of Winning Without Borders with me, Kenny Nguyen and I would like to welcome you guys to my new apartment here in the Fumi Hung District. I have been living here with my roommate, her name is Jessica, last name Nguyen, just like myself. No, we are not related but we met through a friend. So this is my new apartment, I moved uh, out of my family's home from District 6 about a month ago and uh, we're just getting settled in. And uh, today is a very special day because we are actually having our first housewarming party. Today I'm getting ready for this party. You know, as you can see, there is a lot of liquor in that box right there. And our fridge is going to be fully stocked with beer as well. I created the event page a few days ago and I was only expecting about 10 people to show up, but we might expect around 20. So I'm so excited, cannot wait to bring everybody over, show them the place and uh, you know, just have a good time. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna do a quick tour uh, of my apartment. So this is called Cosmo City and uh, this is a very modern apartment. Just was recently uh, built and finished like a couple months ago. So we are renting it out for about six months. Uh, Jessica, she managed to bargain it down to 550 USD per month. Initially, it was 650, but uh, she has really good haggling skills. So saved us a lot of money. Um, I pay a little bit more because I actually have the master bedroom and it has like uh, my bathroom inside. Uh, she is renting the room right toward my left side and it actually has a nice view uh, of the city, which I will show you in a bit. This is the entrance where people come in and out over here. We have our refrigerator, Samsung, and also a 10 year warranty on that. So if we break something or if it breaks down, then we are totally covered and yeah. But the um, fridge here is quite tiny, um, so anytime we buy food, we would have to get rid of it within like a few days because there is absolutely no room to store anything else, as you guys can see. It's full of beer now. Hopefully it will be gone because, um, yeah, I need to put some food in there later on. So we need to clear this out. So whoever's coming tonight, you guys got to help me out over here. And over here you can see, this is our counter. We have an electric stove. Thank God, most places that we visited, they actually had like a gas stove and if you ran out of gas, you would have to like order a propane tank and you know, that's, that's just like more work. So this actually works out for us. Uh, water, we get delivered, um, as you can see, from Happy Life. It's a good brand. If you guys are living in Vietnam, definitely uh, check them out. And under our counter, more water. Yeah, we have about five, six drugs in total and this will probably take us about um a month and two weeks to like go through because we go through about like uh, a jug every week but in total this all costs around i think four hundred thousand vietnam dong equivalent to 20 bucks uh so pretty cheap water is so affordable here uh, we have a lot of storage space and most of them is probably empty you can see it's probably we have food, a little bit in here, protein, oils, more protein, you know. Yeah, that's basically it. But uh, the living room is pretty spacious. We have our dining room table over here. Uh, we have the couch and also a TV. Uh, this place comes kind of fully furnished, I would say. Uh, it comes with all the necessities. Of course, we need a dining room uh, table. We need a couch. We need a TV. Of course, we didn't want to buy that. But thankfully, uh, Cosmo City just provided it for us. So this is like a couple of things we don't have to worry about. But uh, huge living room space. And we're going to have like probably 25 to 30 people in here. And the aircon. This is crucial. Another, it's a Samsung brand, a uh, pretty good brand, so it keeps the place nice and cool. Uh, if you can walk down this way, let me turn on. This is Jessica's bathroom. I'm not gonna go in there because, you know, it's her bathroom, not mine. But let's take you to my room. Actually, before that, let's check out this area right here and it is hot today. We're like 100 degrees. This is our washing machine. Um, Toshiba, good Japanese brand, but honestly, it's been ripping my clothes apart. So I need to figure out how to, you know, reduce the speed of the spin cycle because it is tearing my clothes apart. 
and as you can see we are on the 13th floor pretty unlucky floor but uh, nothing has happened yet but you can get a nice view of the Fumihung district which is uh, district 7 and inside here is my room honestly it looked a little bit dirty earlier but I can't show you that so I cleaned it up for you guys this is my room and this is my Chicago flag right over there nice closet space a lot of room um, and then here is my master bathroom with the see-through glass <laughs> but yeah pretty nice everything is pretty modern nice shower head hot water finally because I've been showering um, at my family's home I usually take cold showers but here since we have hot water you know it's pretty nice this one since I'm staying in the master room I'm paying about uh, 300 and ten dollars so about like thirty five dollars more yeah around that my math is correct um but yeah um pretty affordable if i was in chicago i guarantee i could not afford a place like this because this will probably cost around 14 maybe 600 14 maybe 1600 us dollars so right now i'm gonna go down to the pool rest up a little bit and um you know after that i'll come back here and prepare for the party for tonight <laughs> Alright guys, so as you can see, uh, this apartment also has a swimming pool. Uh, most of the options, most of the other places that we checked out didn't really have one and uh, even if they did, we had to pay extra. But this it was all included in the rent and this place is actually perfect because it has a swimming pool. We actually have a mall and a supermarket downstairs. Uh, there is also parking and I am about five to seven minutes away from work. So um, living the good life right now guys So this apartment complex also has a playground for kids and I am gonna be walking to my block right now I stay at block C So I'm back in the apartment. We have two hours before the party begins and I am already stressing out just a tad bit uh, I just ordered ice from this app and uh, they said that the store ran out, so I'm trying to find other stores that sell ice. If not, we're gonna have warm drinks. <laughs> well, what's your channel? What's your channel? Shining Yellow Boy with an eye. With an eye, okay, gotcha. All right, so. All right. We got another YouTuber in the house, and this party is actually underway. Everybody is here? Yeah? Say hi if you want to. They don't seem really enthusiastic, but maybe we get a couple more beers in and then, you know, I think they will be a little bit open. But yeah, our house party is underway. A lot of people are here and we are expecting a little bit more. <laughs> with everybody. So the party is over. We had a great turnout last night. I had so much fun with everybody. So thank you guys for coming out. But now I have to start cleaning. As you can see, the aftermath of the party. And my roommate is not home.
where is she when I need her? Anyways, uh, it's Sunday. I don't want to waste a day. I gotta get cleaning and then head to my family's home. But uh, yeah, it's been a long time since I've done a vlog. Next week I'm going to Cambodia, so I'll have a little bit of content coming up. Uh, other than that, thank you for watching, and we'll see you back here on another episode of Win Without Borders. Bye bye, guys. Thank you.